from Show Homes Online and we are at Oakley Park in Ellesmere Port by McBride Homes and this house house here is the Beaumont a beautiful looking house you can see it's got an integral garage a nice, a nice firm tile there for the garage there very nice, nice detailing in the brickwork so without further ado let's go and take a look Hello, welcome Hello. to Oakley Park yes. by McBride Homes. In Ellesmere yes, and the house type we're going to look at today, Emma, is Beaumont, four bedroom detached. Okay, well, it's our first for us for McBride. Mm -hmm. We've got some rusty shoe covers on now, haven't we? So if you hear some it's noise, it's really messy outside. Yes, it is. Anyway, entrance hall. Yes, Still lovely. Ma Magnolia Dow. Beautiful house from the outside. Yeah, it is. It? Lovely. Right then, shall we? Uh, shall we get started? Right. Uh, we are reverse to plan, I think. Okay. Yes, we well, are. Or yeah. straight, actually. Yes. So, right. I like. Yeah. First and of all. You know what I noticed? This what? Sparkly work. So and I've noticed these beautiful. lovely doors. Yeah. Look the quality of them. That lovely door furniture. So we've got the kitchen. Kitchen, diner, lounge, all in one actually, by the looks of it here. Yeah, it's open plan. So we've got seven and a half meters that way, and I think it is the longest, you've got seven meters one yeah. in width. Right, so let's have a look. So kitchen is actually at the front of the house, and you've got a window there that, that overlooks the front garden, yeah. essentially, and the road. Okay, right, let's take a look at this kitchen. So what have we got? Plenty of cupboards, so they've got, um, Standalone washing machine. What's that called? It's not integrated. It's on its own. Yeah, it's a, it's an appliance anyway. So space for your washer there. Work surface is beautiful. It's like a granite. Absolutely lovely. Obviously, I don't know what's uh, included and what's additional. So you've got an integrated dishwasher though. Right. It says here these items are not included. The granite worktops and the price to purchase it is two thousand one hundred and forty pounds. Right. For these work surfaces. Ooh. But they look like they're worth it to me. They're absolutely. Let me have a little look. So you've got a pot there, four burners. What have we got here? We've got a bank of cupboards. So you've got your oven and grill. That's your fridge and freezer. Cupboard space above. Oh, so I'm just another cupboard at that end there. Nice kitchen. got electrolux um, appliances. Yeah. So they've got this as your dining area then, which is kind of joined to the kitchen, but it's on this L shape. Yeah, it's so quite it's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. But then you've got French doors there to the uh, to the rear garden. I can hear your shoe protectors rustling as you walk along. Right. Well, I'm just going to... Never gonna... mind. Never mind. Right. Let's have a look. These items are not included, so the carpet throughout excluding wet areas. So if you want to purchase the carpet, £2,560. I do like the way they tell you the price. Yeah. It is what it is, isn't it, if you buy yeah. it off them. Yeah. There's Lovely no, sunny day today. No confusion then about what you're getting and what you're not getting. So this is the actual lounge. Yeah, it's a very, very bright sunny day. Nice garden. Feels very homely, this room, doesn't it? it yeah, but it gives a, a kind of a different feel, I suppose, because we come in through the kitchen and yeah. come around this way. Usually, we come through a door and we're straight into a yeah. room, aren't we? Yeah, what do you think about the open plan? Yeah, I like it. It's nice. I think it just makes that part of it, doesn't it? Yeah, and obviously all I've got is the the measurements of uh, uh, the whole. I haven't got the separate yeah. lounge, dining and kitchen dimensions. Well, you've got this wall that comes out here. Yeah. Would, would, it, would it make any difference if that wasn't there? This well, wall that protrudes I, out? Does it just give that... I don't that know. And I think if the wall came across, it would make the lounge seem quite small. Yeah. Yeah, because I suppose... Forget, this is a four-bed detached, this house. Yeah. So this is all the, the space you've got on the ground floor, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, and I suppose it's making that contrast between the kitchen and the dining room mm. and the living room. I like it. That, the furniture is beautiful. I love the gorgeous curtains. Floor to ceiling. Yeah, very, very, very nice. And it's very warm in here because it is bitterly cold yeah. outside. So right, back into the hallway then. This is your downstairs cloakroom. I'll let you open the door. Very tasteful, just plenty of headroom there as well. So I have got a dimension for the loo, and it's one meter seven by 
82 centimetres. Okay. Very, yeah. very nice. Okay, I've got another. That to, that's, that's the kitchen. It's weird, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> so the other side of this wall, you've got yes. your garage. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Right, well, let's take a look upstairs. Right. Okay, then, first floor. Right, obviously, we're reversed to plan, so I think if we start in here, this should be bedroom four. Yeah. So this is essentially your box room, your, your smallest bedroom. Lovely wallpaper. Like yeah, the, it is, isn't it? I like the monkeys very much. So this is a single bedroom, isn't it? If I just step past you, then you can show the viewers. It is a single bedroom, but you've got <laughs> a big window in it, yes. haven't you? That's actually got a, yeah. What's, what bedroom is this again, Emma? Bedroom four. Oh, I can't believe how big the window the is. Dimensions are three meters 13 by two meters 74. Very good indeed. Yeah. I like the use of blinds in this house. Yes. A lot of blinds, isn't there? Nice, yeah. yeah. Right, so this is bedroom three. Again, at the front, and you're over the kitchen. Here. And again, you've got the same large window as well. The br the blinds just give it uh, something just that bit different. Yeah, blinds are very nice. Right, dimensions, three metres 30 by three metres 13. So they've got a single bed in here. Do you think you could get a double in? Yeah. Uh, with one bedside table yeah at a posh yeah i think or maybe a, a queen size they yeah. call them don't they <laughs> i mean it's not even as if if you could say well i'll turn the bed the other way and have it this way i still don't think you'd have any more space yeah as a push yeah good room though i'm very impressed with the size of these rooms so there's your main bathroom let's have a look so we've got um, a separate shower there, look, yeah, which, runs, the which is which is quite nice, um, which I imagine maybe runs off the boiler. Um, it's nice, a really nice, um, really nice sink here. I'm just trying to look for the make it ideal standard. Um, it's saying here that the bathroom tile in here, which is these, um, is two hundred and fifty-two pound, um, and half wall tile in is two hundred and eighty-five pound, nineteen pence. Very specific, isn't it? Very good, but it's really nice, really nice. Got a towel rail way, as well. There's no confusion about the no, prices. No, no, you actually, and that's confused. the first time we've seen that. Yeah, the actual specific cost. Right, you've just gone into bedroom two there. So bedroom two's got a nice a loft access there. Yeah, dimensions are three meters sixteen by three meters and just a fraction over. Very mm. nice, isn't it? A good double bedroom with built-in wardrobes. It feels very homely. This house does to me. It's your cylinder, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Last but not least, master bedroom. So this is your bedroom one. So you've got a really nice um, sliding wardrobe there. Yeah. Good height as well. Dimensions: four meters by three meters sixteen, and this master has got an ensuite. Show the viewers out the window. Well, I'm going to try to. You can see that the development is well underway. Yeah. I can't really see the garden. The blinds are very nice. What do they call these wood? These blinds like that, Emma. You're more of a. Are they? What are these blinds well, called? The, these. Yeah, we can get. They're the thicker yeah. Venetian blinds. Venetian, aren't they? yeah. You, you can get kind of colonial shutters, very similar yeah. in the thicker, which which are lovely. Look at the shadow it, it makes on the bed there, and you yeah, can I see like the like some little diamantes on the bed. Beautiful, isn't it? Shining, yeah. Right. Have a take a look at the uh, the ensuite. Some beautiful artwork in this house as yeah. well. Really lovely pictures. Oh, this is very Not nice. There is in here as well. Yeah. So here we go. Um, ensuite bathroom. Nice tiling. Rainfall shower there, and also another little additional shower. Um, got the same ideal standard sanitary wear going on. Um, it's really, really nice. Really nice what roof. What does the little sign on the windowsill say? Well, it, there you go. Have a read. Oh, for again, it's just prices of time. Yeah, okay. that's it. Everything you need in an ensuite, then, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. Okay. There is a lot of activity going on out there, isn't there? Yeah. Well, yeah. it's a good, it's a good room, isn't it? It's lovely. Look at us. We're bet, I bet we're covered in blinds. The sun now. is in my eyes. Oh, I tell you what. Recently, we've had some right miserable days, and and, yeah. and today's a quite a nice day for it's showrooms. Been very, very cold. Um, yes. So this is the Beaumont four-bedroom detached by McBride Homes at 
what was it called again? Ells- well, we're in Ellesmere Port. Oakley Park. And um, yeah. McBride, a very north, northern-based developer, sort of northwest, mm-hmm. um, got developments all over Cheshire, that that sort of neck of the woods. And it's nice to bring you a different developer. So it's just another developer for you to consider yeah. in your search for your new home. And they told us that there are a thousand new homes in just in, in this, this little area, small vicinity. So but, that oh my God, busy for a while. Cheshire Oaks is just around it's the corner. And minutes. great motorway networks as well. You can't go wrong here, can you, with no. this location? Anyway, lovely viewers, I will put all the information about this house and this development in the description box down below, so check that out. It'll also have a link back to McBride's website if you uh, if you want to navigate your way back to there for more information about availability yeah. and prices, etc. And, wa- and if you watch us, leave us a review on our Facebook uh, page, mm-hmm. Chance Online UK. Um, and uh, we'll, we'll catch you we on our will. next video. Bye-bye. Bye for now.